clear, yeah. you want a reading on money and you're saying that somebody owes you, person, owes yeah. you some. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't Just need to, to know okay. the name or anything. All I need to know is, as you say, somebody has not given you money. Okay? Yeah. Well, let's just leave it at that and let's see what the guides and angels say. So let me just cleanse these cards. And I always ask for the highest guidance from my guides and the angels. Okay. So let's see what's going on. And remember, this... The situation you're in, this is a really, really good topic at the moment because we've got so many people in the middle of this pandemic that are short of money, they're having problems, they can't pay their bills, etc. So I'm glad you've asked a question like that because I think a lot of people will be like you, waiting for people to give them money. So let's see what's going on with this guy. So I'm shuffling these cards and as you know, what I like to do is whichever ones jump out because then my guides and the angels have guided us to that. So let's see, that's one. Let's just get this situation. So we're gonna do three cards to begin with, okay? And see how they're looking. Okay, so first of all, please don't worry. I know you're looking at the card, your reaction is like, oh, they're not literal. But okay, somebody on the ground here with lots of knives. Don't worry about that, it's an image. So let me tell you what the guides and angels are talking about. The person, and they're telling me it's male that owes you this money, okay, he literally feels from, that he's been stabbed in the back. He feels like either his business or his finances has gone down like that. He's got several people, not one. I mean, look at this, this is a number 10 card. He's got at least five to 10 people that haven't paid him. So what they're saying to me here is, you're waiting for him to give you money. What they're telling me is he's got about five, six, seven, eight, up to ten people, debtors, if you want to call it that, that haven't paid up, so they haven't given him the money. So I think what's happening is he's waiting for them to give him money so he can give you money. So what he's using at the moment, they're telling me, uh, delaying tactics. Like he's trying to keep you sweet and happy and say, oh yeah, I'll do it this day of the week, or I'll do it that day of the week. And he's trying to buy himself time, okay? So remember, he's waiting for some money to come in before you get your bit. And apparently, the money coming into him, 10, 10, is 10 times worth what you're waiting for. Are you with me? So he's waiting for a massive big chunk, and you're like, he's thinking about you, not being disrespectful, they're saying. You're not... Okay, I have to be literal, okay? You're not the biggest fish in the ocean at the moment to him. Are you with me? Your little bit of cake like that is like that. He's looking for somebody owing him the whole cake. So you're not as important as you'd like to think you are. He's got bigger debts and waiting for people to give him money. When he gets some money, let's see whether he puts you on his list. So look, literally, this is a money card. So he's there waiting. Look at him. He's got his chin on the things, so he's waiting, going, oh, I can't believe this, can't believe. So he's waiting and getting frustrated. He's waiting for this money to come in. But listen, the good news is for you, he's going to get the money. Are you with me? That money that he's owed is coming in. It's here. That's a 10 card. But look, we've gone straight on there to a seven card. So you could be with a seven when I read seven days seven hours are you with me in this short time period we're not going to years and we're not going to months even they're telling me but within the next week there'll be movement with this money so just try i know it's difficult to you because it's obviously a big amount to you but to him in his context it's a small amount that he owes you he is going to pay okay he is going to pay because he will have the money okay so i'm pleased to see that that doesn't mean to say he hasn't got the money and the other card the final card here Yes, he's got some money, okay, and he won't have told you this, but they're telling me he has got a little bit of money stashed away. You know how people say, I've got a bit of money put away for a rainy day and whatever. Yes, he has. Do you know why? Look at it. But it's not out in the open like that. It's tucked away somewhere, so he might have it in some property or a bond or an oyster or whatever. So he can't really touch it, but he's got something for his own rainy day. But he's not going to go into that money to pay you okay he feels like he's got a couple of other people maybe he's got staff or employees as well he feels that their need might be greater than yours at the moment so i think there's some staff wages or something he might need to pay first he's got his own little stash kept there but when he gets this money you will get paid i mean thanks 
And by the way, I swear my life, I was fucking said that to Roger today. I swear what? my life, that is 